Oh, you gotta be kidding me. They show up here? Now of all times? I mean, I know I invited them to Earth, but this is ridiculous! What are you idiots- what are you two idiots doing here? Hmm... Let's see... Hey! Huh? Wow... Yep! Hmm... Hmm... <laughs> yep. Hmm. <laughs> yes. What? Uh, are oh, you? Wow. Uh, <laughs> no. Oh my. Yes. Yep. Hmm. A dinosaur? Oh, a dinosaur? That's what you're wa asking? Why didn't you just say so? I'll kill- I'll help you for it. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's not- Oh my god. Oh my god. These guys are gonna- These are gonna get themselves killed. Ugh. I invited them to Earth, but this is the worst possible time. Huh? Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Bro, all right. I know we were sick. We have to get to Ginger Town, but I can't let these two idiots get themselves killed. Besides, it's just a dinosaur. We can take our pickle can handle those in his sleep. With his with one with with his pinky with one arm tied behind his back. And his pinky finger. While blindfolded. He could do all that while blindfolded one hand tied behind his back and all using only his pinky finger on the other one. That's how easy this would be for him. And there it is! I feel sad about trying to hunt down a dinosaur, a rare is Oh my god, it's so shiny. Oh well, time to waste it. Oh no! Oh no, it's charging at me! This is so scary! By the way, what is with those things that are out coming out of his body? Are they like scales? I wonder why they call this Dorosaurus. It's super durable. Better make them leave. Once again, I apologize for the inconvenience, people. I did not plan for this. I just happened to stumble upon them. Oh no, come on! <laughs> come now. <laughs> Give me a break. What? Hmm. I don't know what you're doing here on Earth, but you got some. Whoa! Wait, that guy looks familiar. <sighs> what? Wait a minute! What? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> yes. Malone, you're a travel guide yeah. now? <sighs> oh, good for you, man. <sighs> hmm. 
You're going to yard run? Oh yeah, Goku was there. And I'm glad to see, and you know, I'm actually glad to see that he, that uh, Malone managed to get off of Namek before it exploded. I was worried about him. I like him. I owe ya. Besides, any friend of Gohan Krillin is a friend of mine. Bye! Yay, Whoa, more fruit juice! <laughs> Now don't go wandering off and stop getting in trouble. <sighs> ah, it's worth it. Ah, it's worth it, but that's what any job's like. <sighs> now where was I? Oh yeah. We were going we were going to a town uh, where everyone's disappeared. Alright, monster. You're in trouble. No one's Well this is classic. The moment God disappears, suddenly the rapture happens. Nothing but clothes. So, they're either all dead or they're signing the world's first mandatory nudist colony. Either way, this is not good. Oh no. No epic so entrance? Show your face, monster. <laughs> And no drinking the people? What the hell, Bandai? What's going on? I can sense Goku's energy from this creature. And Vegeta and Frieza's too. What the hell are you? Oh, you don't need to know that. All you need to know is that I'm going to enjoy you as my next meal. Demon King Piccolo. Hmm? How do you know my name? Like I said, there's no need for you to know. Now prepare to be devoured. I see. So you're not gonna talk, huh? You've got the wrong Namekia. Sorry to disappoint. Believe it or not, I think I'm actually kinda glad you rid the town of all of its residents. And why is that? So we can do this. Because now I don't have to hold back. All right, let's let's yeah, let's, let's this squash this bug. <laughs> Face it, give it up, give it up. Three. I'm faster, I'm faster than you. My Kong goes up What the? That's go. That's your technique. All right, break. How you know? Uh, who am I kidding? How you know our techniques? I ask. Clearly, as as though I don't know wait, how that happens. Why am I reminded of the Dark Crystal? Did Toriyama and Steel- Did Toriyama get the inspiration from Jim the Dark Crystal? Oh no! Ah! His arm! He's drinking his arm! Oh, that is disgusting! Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh yeah, I forgot We are free guys now! We are gonna kick your ass! Cannot escape the inevitable! Oh, oh man, that must be it must be his first time getting stabbed like that because his muscles are tight! Unfortunately for Piccolo, that's also gonna be his last. Damn it. 
Ah, I'm sorry. Takahata 101 always made Cell sound so cool. I mean, creepy. Creepy, but in a cool in a creepy way. and Frieza naked in the shower. Wait, Frieza all never wears clothes. Oh! Well, this thing's just full just of surprises. Just the hell are you? Why do you have Goku and Frieza's energy? I suppose I might as well tell you, seeing as how you'll be dead soon enough. <laughs> I'm an android, you see, and you can call me by my name. Cell. Dr. Giro created me in a lab on his computer. <laughs> Dr. Giro again? Oh god damn it, I hate that old man. Long ago, Dr. Giro gathered the genetic material from the strongest fighters in the world to create me, the ultimate android. But it took too long, so he abandoned the project. Fortunately, his computer picked up where he left off and continued his research. Cells from Goku, Piccolo, Vegeta, and even Frieza and his father were collected when they arrived on this planet. Using a tiny bee-sized spy robot created by Dr. Giro. The computer already has enough cells to begin its research, but the process is slow and it will take 24 years to complete. Impossible. We completely destroyed Dr. Giro's laboratory. The computer is located in an underground facility deep beneath his laboratory. You mean it took you three years after arriving here to go from an egg to that? Once I revert to an egg, I must bury myself underground for three years. There my form matures. I see. One final question. I have to know. Why here? Why this time period? Dr. Giro's computer informed me that my evolution will morph two different life forms before I achieve perfection. And those two life forms are Android 17 and 18. You know, in hindsight, I think Team Four Star did the right idea by keeping it vague, by keeping it a lot more vague in the abridged series. What? Unfortunately, despite searching far and wide, I had quite a problem locating those pesky androids. It seems they were nowhere to be found in my era. But in a stroke of luck, I learned that Trunks had a time machine. So I used my magnificent skills and abilities to kill Trunks and steal his time machine. Then I used it to travel here to find the androids. <laughs> But why this point in history? And Trunks had already programmed the time. I just pressed a switch and the machine did the rest. Oh, I think I'm getting it now. Trunks was able to defeat the androids in his future and program the time machine for this time to come and tell us. That's not all the computer told me. It is said the moment I achieve my perfect form, I will acquire a power beyond all comprehension. Thanks for helping me solve this little mystery. But you're not getting that perfect form of yours. Piccolo! <sighs> Drunks, what's he doing here? Ah, he used the time machine. How very clever of him. What can I say? Multiverse Fury's a bitch. So this is the guy who attacked all those people in Ginger Town? He must be the thing that left the exoskeleton near the time machine. You got that right. I'll fill you in on the details later. First things first, we need to squash this bug. <sighs> now may not be the best time to battle. Very well. 
But know this, Android 17 and 18 will be mine. So <laughs> No! He's gone! No! He got away! Damn. I can't get a damn trace it, damn on it, him. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! Great! One Meanwhile. of the huge power levels that showed up out of nowhere is gone now. I can't sense it, but the other one still remains. Wh what, what is the meaning of this? Is that the Namekian? Is that me? Is that me stronger than me? I'll kill me! Piccolo? You, Namekian, too strong! Explain now! Talk! What the hell happened here? He fused with Kami to become Tien's stronger. Apparently on his way here too. Once he arrives, I'll tell you everything. Tell me one thing first. How did you increase your power so much in such a short period of time? It looks like he fused with Kami. That's all it took? What is it with all these low lives? How dare they attempt to surpass the greatest Super Saiyan in the universe? I can't stand this anymore. Look what you've done, Kakarot. Looks like Tien's here. Good. Yeah, he followed your screaming. Here's what's going on. There's another android on the loose. Oh, I see. So, to prevent Cell from achieving his perfect form, we either need to find him and kill him, or we need to find androids 17 and 18 and kill them. Those are our only options. Or we all team up and gang if up on Cell. Me, our best bet is to take Cell out before he acquires too much power. I'm tired of all these pathetic tactics. I say we let him absorb the androids. I don't care who I'm up against. I will destroy them. Don't be naive, Vegeta. We could barely handle 17 and 18 ourselves, and Cell's much more powerful than them. You dare underestimate my power? I'll become stronger. I swear I will. I will go beyond Super Saiyan. Beyond Super Saiyan? What would that Saiyan? make you? A Mega Saiyan? Is that even possible? Ultra Saiyan? Maximum hey, Over Saiyan? Uh... Why don't we just go back to the lab and destroy Cell before he's finished? Multiverse Good theory, dude. Let's do that. At the very least, we'll create an alternate future where Cell doesn't exist. All right. Krillin and Trunks will go on and head back to the lab. Me and Tien will continue searching around here for the time being. Right. Well, if we come up empty, we'll just head back to Kami House. We can check the news for clues. All right. All right. Let's go, Trunks. Thanks. Uh. Go beyond Super Saiyan? Is that even possible? Um, you bet your bomb dollar it is. Whoops. <laughs> you weren't supposed to see that. Guessing we can't just go back into the past and scrap the androids there, right? Right. Nope. It's likely that anything we do in that timeline won't affect this one. Do I have to keep saying this over and over again? Multiverse theory. It's standard time travel 101. Yup. Oh, hey, look, snowman! And if we're able to destroy the androids and sell here, they're still gonna exist in your future. Am I right? Yeah. But if Goku and the others can figure out their weaknesses here, I can go back to my future and defeat them myself. Their weaknesses, huh? Yeah, here's hoping. We'll figure something out. Huh? Yeah, we'll yeah, I'm not worried. We'll always find a way. 
Dr. Giro's computer and cell are down there somewhere. Hmm. I think this is it. Yeah. So, should we just go ahead and blow it up? Not yet. We should head down there and see what we can find first. We might be able to discover something about how to defeat the androids. Ah, right. Then let's make our way inside. And so, Krill and Trunks checked both the interior and underground facilities of the lab. Afterwards, they blew the entire lab and the board and super early board cell to prevent it from developing. Well, that's a... well, that sucks. Did it! Right! Now, Cell won't be a problem in this timeline. And now, we got an ace up our sleeve. Good call saying we should dig around the lab. Yeah, now we have blueprints about the androids. I would actually be able to find the blueprints for androids 17 and 18. If we show these to my mother, she should be able to figure out how we can defeat them. True. Actually, would you mind taking this to my mother for me? I have something I need to do. Huh? You're not coming? No. I thought I'd do some training with my father. If he's able to go beyond Super Saiyan, then I should too with proper training. Well, Vegeta's not exactly a team player. He probably won't want to train with you. You may be right, but sparring with someone leads to greater results in a short amount of time. Even my father should know that. It's worth a shot at least. Right. Sounds like you know what you're doing. Reading you loud and clear. Thanks. Break. Hmm. Meanwhile, I wonder how Goku's doing. He should probably be waking up anytime soon. Any, any, any time now. Where's Goku? Where's Goku? Goku, Goku, Goku. Then, Trunks sought out his father, Vegeta, while Krillin made his way to Bulma to deliver the blueprints. Impressed and terrified by Dr. Jiro's genius, Bulma searched for the android's weakness. Meanwhile, First two, and then three days had passed. And Cell is nowhere Hidemo to be found. And the others, using Kame House as their base, continued their hunt for Cell but to no avail. They could do nothing but watch as news of more victims spread. Every time he slips away, another city disappears. Has made its way to a town in South District 48. Half the residents are gone. Hmm. So he's made his way south. Well, come on! We might still be able to catch him if we leave now. Good luck! Uh, thank you, Roshi. sure is a force to be reckoned with. Oh, did everyone uh, why leave? Why can't we have Goku? Go on, too? Great so. Go on. Please be careful. He'll be I fine, Chi Chi. He's with everyone else. Monster. <sighs> Goku! No way. Hey! Are you feeling better? Yeah, I'm all better now. You're awake! Oh, thank goodness! Wait, shouldn't you be blasting waves into the ocean? Sorry to worry you, Chi-Chi. And you too, Master Roshi. Ah, we're just glad you're better. By the way, it looks like everyone left. Are they after that cell guy? How do you know about yeah. that? But how did you know about him? I heard everyone talking while I was asleep. I think I got the gist of what's going on. Oh. I think I've got a train, too. You're going to fight? Again? No way. You're in no shape to fight. You need more rest. Relax, guys. I'm not going to fight anyone just yet. I mean, if Vegeta can't handle him, then there's no way I can. I'm going to have to train and reach even higher levels. Higher than even Super Saiyan. A level even higher than Super Saiyan? Chi-Chi, I want to take Gohan with me when I'm training. Is that okay with you? Fine. You're kidding, right? Though I guess there's nothing I can do to stop you if I say no. 
fine. True. If you're going to train him, then make him strong. Thanks, huh? Gigi. But once the fight's over, it's straight back to his studies and nothing else, no matter what. And you're going to get a job. What? Oh, no, please! Thank you! All right, time to go. Please, no. This is why he well, himself died, didn't he? Just to get out of a job. If we approach ah, they keep this reusing thing, the same music. We won't have to worry about him reading our power levels, don't you think? Yeah, He's but it's super woman. slow. Even if we get close, we're still going to have to flush him out. Goku! <laughs> Yo! How did you get here? Was it that instant transmission thing? Yep. Get back to 100% then? Yeah. But I'm kind of hungry. Classic hey, Goku. Hey, <laughs> We don't have to combine our names. I'm mostly Piccolo, so just call me Piccolo. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. It, but I'm not powerful enough right now to take on the androids and that cell guy. But I think I've got an idea. I'm gonna take Gohan somewhere we can get a year's worth of training in one day. That's right. The hyperbolic time chamber, of course. Wait. No one has ever been able to last an entire year in there. Even you could barely last a whole month before. Oh yeah, but you almost are died. Than before. We'll be fine. Yeah, don't he's forget, super strong now. We can bring Vegeta and Trunks along with us. They'll be able to handle it for sure. Then get a move on. Cell's killing more and more people, and his power's growing every minute. Right. Goku, let me ask you something. Are you afraid we might be up against someone scarier than Frieza? Or are you happy about that? Both. <laughs> well, I'm glad to see that you're not giving up. There's that. Go on, let's go. We'll grab Vegeta and Trunks on the way. Okay. Where do you think Vegeta and Trunks are training? Let's see. I'm picking up some energy way over there. I'm guessing it might be them. It just occurred to me, this is the first time they're actually be playing in the same party. Wait. I wonder if we'll get to, well, huh. I wonder if we'll get to actually play, to train in the hyperbolic time chamber. Oh man, that'd be so cool. But in the meantime, though, I think we've uh, uh, unlocked every region in the game. Except for this. Except for this area. Oh, well. Oh, well. Let's go get Vegeta. Let's go get uh, Prince Krabby Pants. And it's, his, and it's his way cooler son. Until next time, guys. My name is... Uh, sorry, stretching. My name is Jungle Guy, and I hope you guys have had a fun day. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this, this channel. Don't, you know, and hit the bell icon for notifications. Don't forget, don't forget to check me out on Twitter, or Jay-Z Gaming, Instagram for, for my blog, RJ Inc., and RJ Writing, and my blog itself, RJ Writing Inc. Right, right, talking about fan fiction, anime, manga, movies, everything. The works. Until next time, guys, this is Jay signing off. Peace.